Hello, everybody. Welcome to Gotta Be Handmade. I'm Linda. I'm the YouTube personality behind the Gotta Be Handmade channel. I bring attention to handmade artists through my social media platforms. I hope you will visit me on Twitter, Facebook, and I have an Etsy shop all at Gotta Be Handmade. Now today I have joining me Louise. Louise is the CEO of Louise Fashion Jewelry. Hi Louise, how are you? Hi Linda, I'm doing fine. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for having me. Oh Louise, I love your necklaces. Thank you. First of all, tell me, how did you get started creating your jewelry? It was after I retired. I was looking for something to do to fill my time. I happened to pick up the local newspaper and saw an ad for uh, how to make jewelry. So I thought that sounded fun. So it was just a basic class. So I went and joined it. And after that, I was hooked. And I've been on I've been doing it ever since. Good. I'm so glad you did. I love your necklaces. Thank you. Now I tell enjoy me, making them. What do you make your necklaces from? How do I make what do I make them from? Yes. Uh crystals, uh Tibet silver, gemstones. Uh, glass beads, whatever. <laughs> they are beautiful. Thank you. Louise, did you bring some for us to see? Yes, ma'am, I did. Okay. Okay, this is the first one, and it's all tangled, of course. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. Oh, let me get another one. Okay. okay. <laughs> this one is done with a black onyx uh, pendant. Oh, uh, It has wire wrapping around it, and it's done with the uh, halite uh, nuggets. And this is uh, Tibet silver uh, oh. beads. It is beautiful. And oh, everything on the back. Oh, now Louise, what's the price of that one? This one is forty. It's beautiful. This and one's how, forty dollars. And how long did it take you to make it? Well, actual making time is not the problem. It's okay. the design that takes more time. After it, the design could take anywhere from an hour to, to longer. It's just uh, getting it all laid out to what you like. I see. Um, the, actual, the actual stringing part after that's done is very simple. Yes. Oh, it's beautiful. Now, mm -hmm. the piece around your neck, did you create that one? Yes, ma'am, I did. Oh, this, this has a, a rhinestones with a peacock on it. Oh, it's beautiful. And this is done in, in glass beads in okay. red and, and black. And it has a, a brass uh, beads in between. And okay. it's uh, three different strands. This mm -hmm. one will have, this one does have earrings, not these, but it okay. does have earrings to match this necklace. And okay, so you sell sets also. Some sets, yes, ma'am. So you create earrings? Yes, ma'am. All right. When I have enough beads left over, I'll make earrings too. Okay, all right. Now, Louise, where can we get your jewelry? You can get them off of Etsy at Louise Fashion Jewelry. Okay. Now, Louise, how do we care for your 
uh, necklaces and earrings when we get them. We can just keep them in our jewelry boxes. Do we have to do anything special? No, ma'am. The only thing, if you get makeup on them, just wipe them off with a damp cloth and go right on with them. Okay. Now, did you bring anything else for yes, us? Yes, ma'am, I do. I have several different ones. Okay. This is the one butterfly that I just finished this morning. Oh, it's a very long pendant. Yes. And this is uh, at the bottom. It has the uh, turquoise, and then it has a a sun with a, a, a smiley face on it. It has a a feather, silver feather, and oh. a dragonfly, all yeah. attached. Oh, it has charms on it. Yes, ma'am. It's beautiful. And I see you have little turquoise butterflies. Yes, ma'am. These go up all the way to the top. And in between, it's got uh, eight mil there's your eight millimeter uh, turquoise beads with a silver bead cap. And then it has a little tiny silver bead in between. OK. Oh, Louise, that is beautiful. I just finished this one this morning. Oh, and you're sharing it with us. Thank you. It's not on Etsy yet, but it will be soon. Okay. Okay, I have another one. This one is a uh, Lapis Lazlu Blue Gemstone. Very dressy. Yes. It has the blue gemstone beads and the white pearls with a tiny uh, brass bead in between. Oh my goodness. And this is another one that has the earrings to match. Okay, all right. Now yeah. how much is the set? This one is $40 also. Okay, so it's, it's a dressy one, real dressy. It's $40 for the necklace and $40 for the earrings? $40 for the set. Oh, $40 for the entire yes. set? Yes, ma'am. Buy the necklace, you get the earrings too. Okay. Oh, Louise, it is beautiful. Okay. And this one is more casual. It's made with a rustic boot more western cowboy uh cowgirl type yes and it's made with a uh, little bitty turquoise crosses and in, in uh beads oh that is and good the, the boot is a, a cross cut out yes oh that that's beautiful yes i see now, Louise. Yes, ma'am. For creating your jewelry, do you do? How do you come up with your designs? Well, a lot. I just take the beads and go with them. Whatever suits my fancy. I don't know. I do a lot of research. I go a lot on Etsy and other people's. I do not copy. I mm -hmm. get inspiration from there and also on professional websites, but I do okay. not copy. I okay. get inspiration only from there. Okay. But the yeah. biggest part of them, like the butterfly, mm -hmm. I just went with my own design. And same thing with the boot. Well, everything so far I've shown you was my own designs. Yes. You do a wonderful job. Thank you. They are beautiful. I, I just love them. I enjoy making it. I really do. Mm -hmm. it's now, now how, much, how much time does it take to come up with, you said designing takes the longest time. Yes. How much time from the designing to the creation to actually putting it in your e-commerce shop does it take well to after you come up with a design to actual finish the necklace then at least 30 minutes depending mm -hmm. too on how long the necklace is and how okay. detailed 
but okay. at least 30 minutes. I would say on this this uh, lapis lazuli, mm -hmm. that would probably didn't take me more than 30 minutes to actually put it together after okay. I do, after I figured out my design. Okay. The design itself takes hours sometimes. <laughs> yes. Oh, it's beautiful. And then the, the butterfly one, I had it one, one design and I ran out of butterflies, the smaller butterflies, so I had to redesign it. <laughs> oh, so that happens sometimes too. Yes. Oh, it is beautiful. Okay, and I have another one. It's a double strand. This is a turquoise and hot pink. Yes. And, and with silver. It has a turquoise nuggets and hot pink nuggets with the, the beads, the matching colors inside, in between. Oh, yes. Oh, it's beautiful. You know, they say that the 80s is coming back. And those are the colors of the 80s. I have several pink and hot, uh, hot pink and, and turquoise. Uh-huh. It's beautiful. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Now, what's the price of that one? That one's 35 Okay. All right. And I think I have earrings to match it. I'm not sure. Okay. Now, Louise, tell us one more time. Where can we get your beautiful uh, necklaces and your sets, your jewelry? It's on Etsy at Louise Fashion Jewelry. Louise Fashion Jewelry on Etsy. Yes. Okay. Now, everybody, I'm going to put the actual link to Louise's shop under the video after it downloads. So you'll be able to click on it and go right to her shop and see all of her beautiful pieces. Okay. Now, Louise, yes. are you planning to do something different with your line of jewelry? Something that maybe you're working on? I know that creatives always have something in the back of their minds they're going to try. Well, I have lots of ideas to try, but I just don't have any uh, in the making right now. I just finished everything this morning, so I don't have anything that's half finished. Oh, wonderful. So you've been busy. Yes, ma'am. Always. Okay. Right on time, because when we visit your shop, we'll get to see a whole lot of new pieces. I hope so. Louise, thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for inviting me, Linda. I enjoyed it. You were such a pleasure to have on. And I'm so glad that you showed us your new pieces and those that one that you just finished. Thank you. I enjoy them, really. I really enjoy making them. I know you do. It shows in your work. It really does. Thank you. I hope so. Now, everybody, remember, I'm going to put the link to Louise's shop right under the video so you'll be able to click and go to her shop and see her pieces. Thank you again, Louise. Thank you for inviting me, Linda. Everybody, visit me on Twitter and visit my Etsy shop. Visit me on Facebook and Instagram at Gotta Be Handmade because, you know, for the best, it's just gotta be handmade. I'm so right.